The Seoul Metropolitan Government put on an expo for cultural centers around the country, showcasing traditional dance performances and various other stages that represent Korea's unique regional cultures. Our Kim bo was there. 25 cultural centers from Seoul and 22 centers from around the country gathered at Gwanghamun Square on Wednesday to promote local folk cultures and traditional performances as part of the 2019 Seoul Cultural Center Expo. Dongnaegu Cultural Center from the port city Busan displayed its Dongne crane dance. The dance portrays the elegant movements of the cranes that inhabit the area. Gohun Cultural Center from Jeollanamdo Province showed off its paper money dance. Recorded as one of Korean intangible cultural assets, this dance is usually seen in Korea's southwestern Honam region. Shamans in the region would dance with dozens of pieces of paper while praying for the dead to rest in peace. And a team from Suncheong, Jeollabukdo Province, performed the marching song Okcheon Village Dechita. Okcheon Village Dechita uses Korean wind and string instruments, and this marching song usually led the King's Parade in the past. The audience could find it meaningful to see how the old custom of the Goryeo dynasty is reproduced. There were also plenty of activities for visitors to get involved in, such as making lucky bags used on Seollal, the Lunar New Year, or making shoes out of hanji, a type of traditional Korean paper. There was also a center where calligraphers write quotations of people who fought for a Korean independence. As well as attracting locals, the festival gave foreigners a chance to see less well-publicized aspects of traditional Korean culture. Um, it's interesting because all of these shamanistic rituals and shamanistic culture, which you do not find in Asian countries um, anymore today, and um, as a Western peop, uh, guy, I do not even know that it exists or existed. People could also take part in traditional Korean folk games or playing a traditional Korean drum. These performances give people a taste of different cultural traditions of each corner of the country and will perhaps inspire them to take a trip and explore new parts of Korea. Kim Bo-kyung, Arirang News.